largely Attorney General is right. We have to make a distinction between a privilege and a right. For example, you have a right to inherit your parents' property. But that's not a privilege. It's a right. You don't work for it. But to have a privileged position, you must work for it. So, for example, to become a lawyer, you have to go through a course of study over a, a period of time and be proved worthy of the certificate that you have. And that privilege is also not forever. It's not everlasting. There are rules and regulations of, uh, surrounding how you conduct yourself in the privileged position as, of a lawyer. If you default in any of them, the, the license can be taken away from you and so on and so forth. But if you inherit, say, your grandfather's property, uh, nobody can come and take it from you. So, so is accounting. So is also medicine. So is also engineering. You can't transfer that to anybody. It's not transferable. It's not inheritable. It is for you and your, you alone. If you die, you die with it. You can't give your engineering certificate to your child or your this, who hasn't gone through the process. So also you can't give your legal, legal uh, certificates to, or license to anybody to practice. So being a lawyer is truly a privilege and not a right. You, may, you, may, you, may, you can go to the law school. It's a right to go to the law school and pay. But it's not a right to pass. If you don't work hard, you may not pass.